Hello everyone. In this video, let us understand what is myocardial infarction is, what all the types are there and what is the treatment is. Now, infarct means to block or to clog. When blood vessels are blocked, it is called as infarction. Myocardial infarction means when blood vessels that supply blood to the myocardium is blocked, it is called as myocardial infarction. Coronary blood vessels will supply blood to heart tissue. So when coronary blood vessels are blocked, it is called as myocardial infarction. For long term, if it occurs, it results in myocardial cell death. Now, there are two major types are there. ST elevated myocardial infraction, non-ST elevated myocardial infraction. That ST is from ECG. We have PQ or ST waves are there. P wave indicates atrial depolarization. QRS wave indicates ventricular depolarization. T wave indicates ventricular repolarization. When this S and T segment is elevated, it is called as ST elevated myocardial infarction. This occurs when the blood vessels are occluded for a longer period of time. Occlusion means to block it. This is a dangerous condition. Whereas if blood vessels are blocked for a transient or short period of time, it results in non-ST elevated myocardial infarction. So this is what is the difference between STEMI and non-STEMI, NSTMI. Now STEMI is a dangerous condition because the occlusion is for a longer period of time. To treat that primary percutaneous coronary intervention is performed, which is also known as angioplasty. A, <coughs> excuse me. A balloon is inserted and the uh, coronary blood vessel diameter is increased with the help of a balloon. That is called as angioplasty. Sometimes a stainless steel mesh is placed there, which permanently increases the diameter of coronary blood vessel. It is called as stent. Stent deployment is that one. Along with that, uh, anti-thrombotic agents like antiplatelets, aspirin, clopidogrel, Anticoagulants like heparin are also used. Sometimes to relieve the pain, morphine is also used. The other one, non-ST elevated myocardial infraction is not a serious one. So to treat that anti-thrombotic agents like aspirin, antiplatelets and anticoagulants like heparin are also used. So this is about myocardial infraction. Thank you.